Hey everyone, Patrick here. I just got this, Wook I was just pinged on this WooCommerce issue and it's about some sort of changes I made a couple months ago to the email styles in WooCommerce. And rather than manually going through all, you know, 500 changes or commits or just trying to guess what, what commit made this mistake, I'm gonna use a tool called Git Bisect that will help you go through all the commits made and narrow down exactly which one broke things. So let me show you the problem first. So if you're here on your email page and you press preview, you wanna see a preview of what all the WooCommerce emails look like. This is not what they look like. So obviously the preview is broken. There should be some background color and there should be a little like a header behind this text here. So there's definitely some stuff broken. And now we can start Git Bisect. So, um, git bisect start, all right. And then we're on a bad commit. So you just say git bisect bad. And then you need to also need to tell it when, when is a good commit. Uh, so I'm just gonna go back to one of our previous releases off the top of my head, I'm gonna do that. Git bisect good, 2.2.3, oops, version. So that's a tag. All right, so we have, um, 526 commits to go through before finding the one that did this. So let's go through these then. So I'm just gonna refresh this page. Uh, that's bad. Get bisect bad. 263 to go. Preview. That looks better, but is still bad. Yeah, there's a little bit of a header color, but something is still bad. All right, making progress. Now that looks good. That looks like what we want. Get bisect, good. All right, so we're getting closer. That looks good. good. That looks good. 16. Looks good. Eight to go. All right. So we're actually moving through these 500 commits pretty quickly. Two to go. That also looks good. Zero revisions to go. All right. This one should do it. That's also good. Get bisect good. All right. And there it goes, it's gonna show us what happened and it looks like that FC630 is the first bad commit written by me, yep, back in October, so about two months ago. And it, it was when I replaced some old inliner with a new inliner class. So this is definitely something that I did and uh, now I have an idea of where this problem happened. It should happen exactly at this commit and I can now go there and, and fix whatever went, ha went wrong. So yeah, that's how you can use Git Bisect to uh, quickly find an issue in your repo.